the store four times, took second place at the Mr. Olympia. Last year he did what many thought was the impossible. He defeated Ronnie Coleman. He is Las Vegas' very own Jay Cutler back to defend the Olympia title. Right now, if you look at Jay, Jay's condition is, is there. You know, it's not as sharp as some of the other guys, but he's still trying to hold it there. He has plenty of size. Well, they always say Jay Cutler is almost impossible to beat from the front. He's got those feathered line you, quads. You won't beat Jay in the front. You won't beat Jay in the front, period. <laughs> you know. That's the end of the story. It's when Jay turns around, that used to be a vulnerability. He improved on it a great deal. And, and the question is, does he stack up now when he turns around to the back? Okay, last year he was a, a lot better than he is this year, but he's still trying to make a name for himself. If you look, he has improved a lot through the lower part, but it still could be even better. See, look at the width, though. He has so much size on that lower, on that upper back, and it all ties in just right. But if you look, he's still, he's holding just a tad bit of film there, but it's not bad. As he pulls, he's getting better and better, so he's got to keep it up. Once, once they get done, once they start calling the comparison, you really see a big, big difference then. There you go. See, as he pulls, he gets better. Jay Cutler was extremely 